As they disclose this, Maeve, and as they say, this Ms. MacGyver offered her resignation because she was involved in the speech, and Donald Trump said no. What else does the statement say about what the campaign concludes happens? Does it say, yes, we plagiarized, or at least admit something of that effect? So we are literally getting this uh, right at this moment, and it is actually a speech, uh, it is actually a statement by Meredith MacGyver uh, that I will read to you in full. Uh, she says that she's an in-house staffer at the Trump Organization, a longtime friend and admirer. In working with Melania Trump on her recent First Lady speech, we discussed many people who inspired her and messages she wanted to share with the American people. A person she has always liked is Michelle Obama. Over the phone, she read me some passages from Mrs. Obama's speech as examples. I wrote them down and later included some of the phrasing in the draft that ultimately became the final speech. I did not check Mrs. Obama's speeches. This was my mistake, and I feel terrible for the chaos I have caused Melania and the Trumps, as well as Mrs. Obama. No harm was meant. Yesterday, she says, uh, I offered my resignation to Mr. Trump and the Trump family, but they rejected it. Mr. Trump told me that people make innocent mistakes and that we learn and grow from these experiences. I asked to put this statement out because I did not like seeing the way this was distracting from Mr. Trump's historic campaign for president and Melania's beautiful message and presentation. I apologize for the confusion and hysteria my mistake has caused. Today, more than ever, I am honored to work for such a great family, and I personally admire, admire the way that Mr. Trump has handled this situation, and I'm grateful for his understanding. So, no, the word plagiarism is not in that uh, statement, but what she is saying is that Melania read her passages from Michelle Obama's speech over the phone. She wrote them down, uh, and then they got incorporated into the speech, and they are casting this as an innocent mistake by someone who is clearly going to stay with the Trump organization.